So, hey guys, uh, kind of a different review, and it's on a couple older Star Destroyers that I recently got. I got the Hot Wheels, the Hot Wheels first, and then this older uh, die cast uh, a little bit later, and I actually really like them. So I decided I'd do a little video review on them. Kind of in uh, collecting ships now. Um, the diecast is from like 2006, I think it said. Not sure when the Hot Wheels is from. I like the little extra details on the diecast though. Uh, like little yellow dots for the lighted windows and stuff. I don't know how I can really see that. That's about as good as I can get. And there's... Uh, yeah, there's some on the bridge too. Can't really get that in though. And then the Hot Wheels is just uh like a flat gray color. And the uh, Hot Wheels is kind of a bigger scale. I, I th think they're about the same length. Yeah, about the same length, just the Hot Wheels is a little bit wider. I wish I would have gotten these back when they were still really popular and read more readily available. I got me a Black Series, a new Hope Star Distorer coming in here soon too, so this, this is kind of a part one comparison. The sides are kind of different shape too. The Hot Wheels is kind of more wider. And then the die cast is more like uh, narrower I guess you can say. And then the top of the die cast has the dark gray areas to kind of bring out the details more. And then the uh, Hot Wheels is just a uh, plain gray color. They're both like a uh, die cast kind of material. I would have hated to be the sculptor on these things though. So. I could would have been fun, but probably kind of difficult at the same time. These are the uh, New Hope Star Destroyers, which is gonna be the same for the Black Series too. I get the titanium. There we go. It's pretty cool stuff though. There we go. You can kind of see the lighted window areas. And then the backs are different too. Way different. I'll try and get a good view of the back. There we go. The Hot Wheels has three blue painted engine areas, and the diecast has seven yellow painted areas for the engines.
the uh, this back area is different on both of them too actually on the hot wheels there's like that little bump on the back of the bridge area and then the die cast is like more I guess you can say flat and then there's like little lines like on the very top of the bridge area on I don't know if you can really see that or not. There we go. Actually, there we go. That's a good view. So yeah, those are my older Hot Wheels and titanium die casts. Uh, a new hope started starters. Pretty cool stuff, like I said. Uh, details wise, though, I think I like the die cast, the darker gray one. Uh, that and it has like a little, tiny little tan of four on the bottom. It's a pretty cool feature. So that's it for now. I'll get a video up when the Black Sherry soup gets in. Cool stuff. See you guys.